Hey guys, welcome to part 3 of, uh, mission 2. I forget the name of this mission, but, uh, the second mission, uh, for the campaign on Company of Heroes Online. Uh, this is part 3. I don't know if I said part 2 earlier. Uh, anyways, part 3, part 2.5, what happened there was somebody unplugged my ethernet cable, so I lost internet for like a minute, and they kicked me out of the game, and they didn't save it. So, basically, I had to restart this mission over. It's uh, kind of annoying, but I uh, I did you all a favor and skipped all this boring stuff where I had to secure all the points over here. Uh, basically, what it's saying now is there's going to be an assault. Uh, basically, I already prepared for this. I laced the road with uh, mines. I have two AT guns down here in the uh, south. South east. I've got uh, MGs set up, basically a choke point, so when they come in, uh, where my mouse is circling here, when they come in here, look, you can see all my guys, hold on. Look, I got an MG set up here with a sniper, uh, just a regular airborne squad. I'll uh, equip them with recoilless rifles. Uh, MG is in bunker. I guess they want me to garrison that bunker too. Uh, like, like I said, I have mines all along this road, because I've played this mission before, so I know that there's going to be vehicles, uh, coming. So, I guess I started this video kind of early. I thought the, um, the ambush, or the convoy would come immediately after I captured this last, uh, road sector, but it's not. So I guess I'll have to ramble for about a minute. Um, right now I'm playing on my level 12 Blitzkrieg character. I've been working on him uh, for the past week or so. I beat all the uh, training missions. They were, um... Man, I gotta stop saying um all the time. I should know better. The training missions, not too difficult. The medium level, or the normal difficulty training mission against the computer was more difficult than I think it needed to be, or the map was just a horrible map because it took me like three or four or five times to beat it, whereas on the hard difficulty, I beat that the first time. But I also think that map was favored towards uh, the Axis because there were a bunch of, uh, it was basically an urban map, so I was able to garrison my heavy MG teams, uh, and basically put a choke point on the middle, uh, two victory points, and then that uh, gave me enough time to build up some ammunition and fuel and get a nice uh, group of stugs to protect the other three. And here comes a convoy now. They don't even know what they're getting into. It's a shame that the mines are going to get wasted on these these motorcycle crews. But I don't think any tanks are coming through. I don't remember tanks. But definitely they're going to get tore up. Here we go. Yep. Dominated. Look at- oh my god. Didn't even have a chance. Do I have an extra... I'll just use these guys as extra to set up mines that have been blown up already. So I gotta survive eight waves, I guess. And this is the second one, I believe. The first one almost didn't even touch me. Get out of the way, don't get run over, no! Oh, I forgot guys jump out of the uh, half tracks after you destroy them. Hmm. But they still don't stand a chance. This guy's gonna hit a mine. Boom. Word to your mother. 
Let's set this up over here. The sniper isn't really doing anything. That's because I've denied uh, infantry to get through or escape from their convoys or half track. This reminds me of the um, the scene in Con Air where they basically trap the uh, cops between the in the the junkyard where all the planes are, and they just destroyed them. That was a good movie. Nicolas Cage, gotta be one of my favorite actors. He's in some pretty good movies. Con Air, Matchstick Men. Uh, although some of his newer movies are questionable. Like, uh, what's that one? Witch, witchcraft, something about witches. Which I, uh, don't care to see. Was that eight? Was that eight waves already? Oh, yes. And that is exactly what it looked like. We got sad music playing in the background. Alright. Now I know uh, some missions, well not some, but basically all missions on the campaign are pretty long, so I'll probably make a part one to a mission, and then part two will be significantly farther into that mission, so uh, I'll just like fill, fill you guys in at the beginning of the second part, but I don't want to make like ten parts to one mission, because one, that's more work than I want to do, and two, I don't think everybody wants to watch all ten parts of the same mission. And let's see, I think I got all the objectives and even a parachutist badge. That's pretty nice. So, that's part three of the second mission on Comedy of Heroes online campaign. Um, I know I haven't gotten very many videos up lately. I've been kind of lazy, I guess. There's no really good excuse for not having any up. But, Veerville was the name of that. Carentan, the next mission. I don't know when I'll have up. Hopefully, maybe if I feel ad adventurous, I'll have part one up tomorrow or next weekend. I don't know. But thanks for watching and subscribe if you want.